Spanish conquest of the Aztecs started in February 1519 when the Spanish invaded Aztec territory, which is known as today as Mexico. The conquest lasted for more than two years and it ended in August 1521 when the conquest was deemed successful for the Spanish. Because of the Spanish invasion, it led to the Aztec Empire collapsing and their territory turning into the country Mexico, who speak Spanish. In 1504, Hernan Cortes left Spain to conquer the New World. Explorers such as Cortes were referred to as Conquistators. The ideas of invading the Aztecs for the Spanish came from Christopher Columbus's establishment of the European settlement of the Caribbean. This led to more authorised expeditions of the Caribbean to discover new territory and new settlements. And they eventually found the Aztec territory and invaded it successfully. The peak of the Aztec Empire came in the early 16th century where they, de where they dominated central Mexico and may have had as many as 25 million inhabit inhabitants. After several setbacks, Hernán Cortés began a march inland to the Aztec capital, Tenochtitlan. Tenoc In May 1521, Cortes led the final battle in Tenochtitlan. Hernán Cortes's men were eventually joined by the many Indians who had been conquered by the Aztecs and resented their heavy taxes and brutality. There was a series of battles. In 1521, the Aztecs were vulnerable as early, earlier as a smallpox epidemic had swept through Tenochtitlan and killed a quarter of the population, including their new ruler. Over the next three months, historians estimate that around 100,000 Aztecs and about 100 Spaniards were killed. During the siege of Tenochtitlan, there, was daily attacks. there were daily attacks on the Aztecs. Boats were used to cut off the city from food supplies, and the aqueduct was destroyed that brought fresh water into the city. <laughs> Let's melt bone bounce.